we making, matey? We're making pig legs. Crushed up pork rinds. Half of the spicy ones. When you're a pirate, you need spicy pork rinds. Arr, how do you like my accent? Arr, my pirate accent. I'm working on I'm trying to say what I want to be for Halloween. In this jar, I have bacon fat. I've been saving this for a while. I've been keeping it in the refrigerator, unlike my grandmother, who just kept it on the stove. And uh, we're going to put that into this pan. And then we're going to see the magic happen. Okay, I've melted my oil. Had to, had to take it off of the fire. I get busy fighting alligators and uh, Peter Pan and uh, forgot about it and kind of overheated my oil. Well, that's okay. Peter Pan's fine. He'll live. All right, now, here's what we're going to do. I'll set you up here to watch. Hopefully you can see. Here's my crushed up uh, pork rinds I had. And like I said, I mixed a mix of spicy and not. I have hot dogs here. These are 100% Angus hot dogs. And they are um, two carbs per hot dog. <laughs> okay, so like I said, these are 100% Angus. Uh, these are for later. And these are um, two grams of carb per hot dog, which is not too bad. I'm going to crack a couple of eggs into this long, shallow dish here, and I'm going to stir those up with a fork, kind of get them broke up. I found a fork the other day, finally. <laughs> there have to be forks around here. The rest of the scallywags spike over them. I love talk like a pirate day. I was lousy at it. Oh, scuttle me hot dogs and shiver me timbers. I'm going to do something a little bit different here, and I thought this would be a, a fun thing to try. I'm going to... I'm going to listen to my alarm. My alarm is saying, it's time to go to work. I'm not going to work tonight. I traded. Okay. So we're going to split this hot dog right down the middle. And because I love jalapenos, I am going to stuff some jalapenos inside this hot dog and some cheese. So be right back. Now, Marion, one of my YouTube friends, she is uh, smarter than me. She wears gloves when she deals with jalapenos because uh, she said she scratched her eye one time. And I was like, yeah, I scratched something else. Uh, jalapenos are deadly when it comes to your hands and scratching things. So be careful. Well, now that I've got it stuffed like this, I'm thinking, what else does it need? I know what it needs. Bacon. This is one of those, how you gonna make it better, Grandma? Grandma's gonna wrap that precious puppy in bacon. We're gonna fry it in bacon fat. We might as well wrap this baby in bacon. Now, remember, this hot dog's already a cooked item. Um, you know, they come that way. You can eat them right out of the package. So all we need to cook is the bacon part. I left the ends open. That may be a mistake. Now, I hope you can see this because I'm going to roll this in. And you know where she's going right after this. Yes, I just spilled all my, not all my crumbs, a good portion. A good portion of them spilled. Would someone get on the rudder and hold this ship still? That's not good. I have a terrible pirate voice. Anyway, there's my pork rinds. And I really think for just extra fun, I'm going to double dip that baby. And we're going to put him back in. Oh, is he going to be crispy, crunchy? And we're going to ride over here to the hot oil. I'm going to put that back on the heat again. We're going to drop it in. Oh, fry, Daddy, fry. Then we're going to skewer it. Skewer it. We're going to run it through. I'm going to run it through with me saber. And then I'm going to use it to walk with. <laughs> no, I, I won't. But it's going to be my new peg leg. Right? Coming back when it's done. Found me wooden spoons. I'm going to go paddling in the grease. You don't have enough oil to cover your peg leg. And if you're a little more coordinated than I am, then you can just put the oil up over the top of it like this while it cooks. Now, like I said, we're only cooking the bacon. 
and that's going to go pretty quick. You want to keep your oil on uh, real close to medium high, to high, and you want it to be bubbling like this, you know. And I would say we're going to cook this for a good three minutes. I want to get it nice and golden. I want to make sure that bacon is crispy and the cheese on the inside is melted. Now, of course, you can use any kind of cheese you want. You can leave off the jalapenos if you're a landlubber. <laughs> but, you know, just kind of an interesting thing. I think the grandkids might kind of like them for Halloween or something. Arr, like I told you. Don't worry, I got this. Look at all that good fat dripping off of there. Mm -hmm. Get that over the plate. Mm -hmm. That's right. I know there's a lot of you that are like saying, take a bite, take a bite, let's see if it turned out. And we're going to find out. I've had to let it cool down. These things are hot when they come out. Because, you know, you're frying them. All right. Like I said, cook by the seat of your pants. Arr, I was cooking by the seat of my doubloons tonight. At least I had a better pirate accent. Oh, wow. That is a meal fit for a pirate captain. So I better get out of the galley and go take him some. Well, I don't have a captain. Yeah, I'm going to have to go put on my captain hat, and I'm going to eat it. Well, this was a lot of fun. I love making up recipes and just doing fun stuff. I think my grandkids are going to really like this one. And uh, I hope you enjoy it too, or your version. Any kind of cheese, leave out the jalapenos, put them in, wrap up more stuff, put that bacon around it, dip it in the egg and the pork rinds, and fry it up in your favorite fat. There you go. That's the recipe. And I don't even think we need to write that one down. <laughs> I love you all. Be good to each other. Uh, take care. Don't forget to hit like or subscribe. And uh, I'll see you the next time I get a crazy urge to go swimming in the grease or is it the fats next time i get the urge to go oaring in the fats is it oaring do you or what's it called is rowing i'll see y'all the next time i get the urge to go rowing in the fats bye bye